Hey Pearson Salesforce, I wanted to take a few minutes to point out some of the best features in Burke DeMarzo's new second edition of Corporate Finance. Burke DeMarzo is best known for blending core finance theory with the pedagogy students need to succeed. They do this by using the Law of One Price, which reflects the modern idea that the absence of arbitrage is the unifying concept of valuation. For a definition of this finance concept, check out Chapter 3, page 64. Introduced here in Chapter 3, the Law of One Price is revisited throughout the text. Worked examples provide students with a clear, step-by-step -step process to solve problems. Every important concept in Burke de Marzo is accompanied with a worked example. You can see here that example 3.6 on page 67 specifically references the law of one price and arbitrage within the context of the problem. Common mistake boxes, like this one on page 163, alert students to frequently made mistakes when they misunderstand a finance principle. Knowing these common mistakes up front helps students master the finance concepts better. At the end of each section, you'll see a concept check, like this one on page 64. It asks the students to check their understanding of the concepts they have just read about in the previous section. One of the biggest challenges your instructors will face when teaching this course is helping students see the relevance of finance to their future careers and the world around them. Burke DeMarzo gives students the opportunity to see how finance impacts the world in which they live through financial crisis boxes and practitioner interviews. Throughout the text, you'll see financial crisis boxes like this one on page 71. It illustrates and analyzes key details about the recent financial crisis. This one in particular deals with liquidity and the decline of the housing market. Practitioner interviews show how business leaders use finance concepts in their jobs to make smart and informed business decisions. Take a look at the interview with Senior VP Treasurer of Qualcomm on page 159. He discusses evaluating business projects using key finance tools like net present value. Taking it a step further, Burke DeMarzo helps students put finance into practice with My Finance Lab. My Finance Lab with Burke DeMarzo's second edition features a unique hint and partial credit system, along with resources like finance news and videos. In the second edition, Burke DeMarzo added over 200 new problems to the end of chapter content, which are also available in My Finance Lab. These are just a few hallmark features that you should show your professors when you're walking them through Burke DeMarzo's second edition. Have a great time selling Burke DeMarzo's Corporate Finance Second Edition.